This video will show you how to set up costing tags for timesheets. In other words, when staff are recording their time, they'll be able to select what jobs they were doing, or where they were working. At company level, click on Settings at the top right. Select Tag Sets. And on the right, click the plus button to start off. Enter a name for the tag sets. We're just keeping it simple and select a colour for the tag. Go with blue. Select employee and transaction. These are the standard settings that you would use for a tag set used with a timesheet. Click on the links button there and select employees, time card and time band from the menu. Click the OK button to the right and we'll be able to start setting up the names for our tags. Select the Add Tags button now and in the label enter the name of your first job. In the value put the same name in this case and click OK. Enter the next one. Maintenance. We're just going with a standard farming kind of scenario here. Oops. And click OK. And close. Make sure you scroll down and click the OK button before you go anywhere else. Now we've set up the jobs, we're going to apply them to the timesheet that we set up earlier. On the left hand side of the screen click on Templates and click on Timesheets. Further down the screen where it says Allow Costing, select Yes. And straight away your option is to select the jobs. Click OK. So now we've set up the jobs for the timesheets, let's go and check it out in Run a Pay. Back to Run a Pay. And Jenny's timesheet is ready to go. If we click on the little clock symbol, we can see it in hours or in time bands, but we'll check out hours first. She now has a cost to area here. We'll click the down arrow and choose milking and click the plus. So we can say that on Monday she did two hours, maybe four hours on Thursday for milking. Back to the cost to and we'll select maintenance. On Monday she also did three hours of maintenance, like that. Stock control, maybe two hours of that for each day. And save. Or we can record this in the time band area too. Back to hours and switch to time bands. We'll say she started at 4am, finished at 6am. We don't need a note now, we can just say she worked on milking. Click. Went back again at 7 and finished at 10 and was doing maintenance. We'll go with 1, 2, 6. She was doing stock control. So a lot of stock there. And save it. To see it in the main reports area, at the top of your screen click on the clock symbol and there are all the tags for what she's done and they're all recorded nicely as a CSV file if you click this download button here. Jenny will be able to record all the time against those jobs on her phone app. You might like to watch our next video, How to Create a Costing Template. It shows you how to view the value of the time recorded against those jobs.